What's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. So it would have been your favorite bestie do, but right now it's just cow here. Just because we're, I'm figuring some stuff out. So right now I'm in Strideway and this is basically a mini barn tour for this half the video so um here we are i'm just showing you guys around a little bit just for some people who need to see like where the some of the barn stuff is like if you wanted to know where the walker is all of the other stuff this is a truck with an adorable dog in it so that's pretty slay but right now it's just cow i'm going to be doing a little tour and then after in the second half of this video i will be doing a little grooming session with clover who is actually one of um lucky's i'm pretty sure half siblings somewhere so you'll see that in the second half of this video so make sure to see that it's really crusty so um that's super exciting right now we're inside um here's the little inside of where you find the feed and stuff so if you wanted to role play with the feed this is where you would find it there's also this counter and random cat beds and whoever that thing is so yeah there's also all this where you can find tack and stuff and the helmet actually moves which is crazy um yeah i'm just sitting here in this chair as i can't figure out where to go so in this room this is kind of just like a wash stall area i'm not really sure what this place is for and then there's obviously doors to go outside if you really needed to get outside quickly i don't know just in case like your horse runs away from you on accident so in here is like a tack locker so there's all that there's like a little saddle rack which is really cute and there's also these like tack lockers so you can put like i don't know you would put your boots in there some other stuff we don't really use lockers where i am they're kind of like rare and here um usually you find your food on that side there's like a hay bag but i'm pretty sure you can put food in there or something like that um i don't think the doors open to go outside so you might have to like shove your horse through them but that might work so, and there's a bunch of stalls for a bunch of different role plays and then out here on the very back of the barn as you can see there's um the walker which i'm i really like i think it's really creative and there's a lunging area which i'm pretty sure strideway might add lunging don't like come at us for that but i think they might add lunging i know they're adding fjords though which i'm super excited because then we'll have a real donuts so yeah this is the side of the barn which is also where we went in and out there's a few tiny little paddocks on the outside which like you can put your horses in for role plays or things like that so if you really need that you can use those paddocks or something so yeah here's the second part of the video okay hey guys um right now i'm inside of the barn and you might not be saying anything but clover is actually right there with his halter on he's looking super adorable and i just love clover he is somewhat related to lucky i'm pretty sure they're half siblings of some sort because i think they had the same father or same mother one or the other so basically he's super crusty i haven't brushed him in a very long time because we don't use him that much because he's a little spicy he's green and basically i'm going to be brushing him he's super crusty so he's also shedding because it's spring and it's becoming shedding season so yeah you're gonna see me decrustify him so right now we're starting here there's a bunch of dirt flying off of him right now and he's shedding so much i'm literally almost covering in fur already he has like the world's like fluffiest coat ever we haven't clipped him yet so i'm probably gonna clip him soon just because it's becoming spring and i want to end up showing him in october later because he's still a little bit green so i might put him in like the novice horse classes in october just so he gets all set okay i can't get onto this wall he's pushing me that way let's just um stay over here for now good boy he doesn't really like people going behind him so i'm really trying to train him to do that just so he can become a lesson kids for some or a lesson pony for some of the lesson kids that want to ride him i can't talk today please don't come at me um yeah he looks gorgeous in this green halter i'm really loving it next we're gonna go in with some other brushes just since we got all the dirt off so i'm gonna use the metal curry comb just to get more of like the scrubbing not the scrubbing but like getting all the dirt off and also getting making sure all the hair falls off because he's really shedding as i said this a million times his feathers especially are shedding so badly oh i'm stuck in the saddle rack let me out back to business with clover i love clover he is a roan cob and he's super cute but he's also like really fluffy as i've said this a million times it's really hard to get that side so maybe like after i finish this video and put him in his paddock for a little bit just because when he rolls i'm probably going to clip him then just because i know he's already going to roll in his paddock and then we're going to have to clip him which will be fine because i'm just brushing him before and i think i'm going to put him in his paddock then just so he's fine okay so um i need a 
put some stuff in there because I can't fit it all in here. Okay, let's do the hoof brush. So right now I'm taking the brush and I'm just painting his toes because they're very delicious. No, actually, don't come at me. But yeah, those are some nice um, addition. And then he's really like weird about the fly spray. So we have to be really careful because he is a little bit green. So we don't want him to, oh my goodness, mama pony. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I didn't mean to mount him, but it's actually a perfect time because I just flood sprayed him. So I'm going to put him in his bag just to finish off this video. And so I can clip him after this without being absolutely covered in fur and not being able to talk. So yeah, here we go. I really don't feel like walking him. So I'm just going to ride him. It also will give us some time to bond. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.